What's going on, y'all? It's Zini back with another You Heard, You Feel Me. I got a hell of a about boy. I got a hell of a about boy. And if you haven't subscribed, you should subscribe. If you haven't followed my social medias, you should really follow my social medias. Everything will be linked in the description. My mail page is going to be in the description. It's going to appear right here. That's my Instagram mail page. Anyways, thank you guys so much for supporting me and subscribing to me. I currently have 930 something followers. Thank you guys so much. I reached 900 yesterday. I appreciate you guys so, so, so much. Thank you guys. Because just like last week, I only I had like 500. So, thank y'all. Okay. So, anyways, somebody suggested a soak off acrylic nail video. So, that's what I'm going to bring y'all. I promise you guys I have more nail videos and more videos that are not related to nail. Because I've gotten a lot of video like requests like do this do that so i'm planning a lot i have a video in process but i can't upload it because it's a challenge it's like a two week challenge so i can't upload it like this week obviously but i have a lot of new videos like outfit ideas and other stuff i won't spoil it but let's just get into the video okay you guys so hopefully you guys could see this so you are gonna need acetone cotton balls a nail clipper these if you have these if not you could use foil or some people just like get a ziploc bag and just put their hands like that whatever you want and then a cuticle pusher just Y'all gonna see. I can't explain stuff, y'all. I'm really bad at explaining. And that's why I do not do voiceovers or anything. Like, some people be like, um, say what you do and stuff. I'm really bad. Like, I'm really bad at explaining stuff, y'all. But this is, like, basically to, like, push all the acrylic off your nail. Alright, y'all. So, I'm gonna try to do a voiceover. I don't be doing this. I'm just telling y'all. So, first, just cut off. Ooh. cut off all the nail cut off all the nails where like your nail is like your natural nail that's self-explanatory Ooh, like so make sure to do it on both hands you know, repeat the same process on the other hand. What you're doing on one, you do up to the other. So. Yeah. Okay, you guys. So, I drilled them off a bit. So, even though these, I could take them off like this if I wanted to. That's not the correct way to take them off. When I was little and I used to have acrylics, I thought that was the right way. Because people used to say that was the right way but it really isn't so i'm gonna get my acetone and i'm gonna get this but i'm just gonna put it in like that oh well i've seen no videos do it like this so that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna repeat it for all other four fingers i'm gonna show you how this hand first and i'm gonna do this hand off camera so you repeat it for all the other four fingers or your other fingers so i'm gonna wait a few minutes before i take these off and i'm gonna catch y'all okay y'all so i know someone's gonna ask me like stephanie where did you buy these i these actually came with like my uv light or my drill that i bought on amazon so i didn't buy these separate but if you guys want to buy these i will find an amazon link because i buy most of my stuff on amazon so i'll find an amazon link to these and it's going to be linked in the description if it's not there then i'm sorry i couldn't find it but best believe i'll find them for y'all
so you guys as you can see this one is like coming off this one has been stubborn and don't want to come off so all right y'all so i took those off because they take it way too long and this is another method that i saw so it's warm water with acetone and oh, i just put the bag of acetone inside the warm water and so yep. there you go i'm gonna file them buff them and usually they put like cuticle oil or nail strainer i don't have that so yeah I'm going to try to fix this nail. They be like with, with the tea bag and gel polish or regular clear nail polish would do. So that's what I'm going to do. But don't follow this because I don't know if it's going to work. But let me file and buff these real quick. Okay, they're buffed and shaped. Oh, I need to shape this one. I mean, filed. I need to file this one more. But, okay, so they say to get a little bit of fabric or tea bag. That's what I did. I got a tea bag and some nail glue. So let's see if this works. So this is how it looks. And then they say to file it. So. That's what I'm doing. So you do. just keep filing it until like it blends in with your nail. I'm still not done. But I just want to say my nail had broke before I was doing all this. Like I was getting something from my backpack and my finger went boom. So yeah. I forgot to say this, but I did push back my cuticle. So now the tea bag feels like my actual nail. I don't got no cuticle oil, so I guess we're just going to skip that step. And I'm just going to paint all my nails clear. Looks like my nail. By the way, this is the clear nail polish I used is by Sally Hansen it has argan oil so yeah you can find this at CVS or your local drugstore or nine nine. okay guys so this is how they look that nail polish really dry fast it's not gel polish so yeah from far away I don't think you can see that I fix this nail unless you know unless you pay attention but this is how they look. I hope you guys like this video. Make sure to subscribe. Make sure to tell your friends to subscribe too. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time.